And okay, I'll let you go from here. Yeah. So you have this inversion, right? Yeah. What we would expect if LDL and cholesterol are causing the problem, we would expect the FH people who have less of it in the artery wall to have lower rates of heart disease and right. the PCSK9 mutation people to have higher rates of heart disease. But we see the reverse of that. So what's going on? Yeah. Now, there's a great paper and the author of this, John Castellane, who's a smart cardiologist, although constrained by the disciplines of his field, wrote a really interesting analysis of FH families in Europe. And it turns out that we have records for mortality for them going back into the pre-modern era. Mm. And it turns out that, and there are other epidemiologists who've, uh, uh, what's his name? Davy Smith. I can't remember his first name. He's a fam another a famous epidemiologist. And his observation was people in People with FH only suffer increased levels of heart disease in high fat diets. And mm -hmm. Castellane wrote this paper showing that people with FH only show increased levels of heart disease in the modern era, in industrial hmm. countries, hmm. right? So something changed. So he went back into these historical records and these people were not dying at higher rates as you would expect. If this was exactly. just a pure like genetic problem that was impervious to an interaction with the food environment in this case. Exactly. Exactly. Hmm. Now, why could that be the case? 